congratulations, man. This one must, uh, it must be particularly sweet for you. Definitely, because I came here today not caring about what position I came as long as it was top two. Winning was just a bonus. And I could just qualify for the Olympics and that's all I'm excited about. I didn't care. Or like I said, this is a bonus wearing this medal right now because I know how hard I've worked. I missed out on two Olympics as it is and I knew this was my third one, which I wasn't just going to let it slip um, between my fingers so easily. And I'm so happy, honestly. I thought I'm going to go home and cry. My whole family going to get so excited. They're over the moon right now because... I just, remember days it was like, everyone in my family wasn't having such a good time at the moment. And I just said, this weekend it's all going to turn around. And it did, because I just booked my um, ticket to Olympics and we're all going. <laughs> As you say, you missed a couple. Your, your career has been up, down, all over the place. This must be so sweet for you. Honestly, sitting there watching, um, okay, 2008, I was quite young and I did broke my leg the year before, but I knew it would have been an experience for me to set myself up becoming a senior. But then when it got to 2012 and then I tore my... Uh, hamstrings that year obviously it was mainly because I wasn't rehabbed the right way I didn't we was running but it wasn't my body wasn't ready yet and now I've just obviously with Steve Farage that we've worked on so many different things and we put it together and at the beginning of this, this season even I always started to question myself like what is going on but I knew that I believed in him which made me believe in myself because when it came down to this final he said I had to go and fight for it because these girls are not going to give it to me easily and I did and that's just put it all together because yes I've missed out on the first two I'm going to put that behind me because I know I'm going to Rio so I'm going to get my bikini and no, I'm joking honestly I'm get your bikini girl you're allowed <laughs> god no I'm, I'm going to celebrate at the end of the season Fair definitely enough. but it means so much to me take me through today obviously the semi-final I thought uh, Desiree all my money all my house everything mortgage was on her to come in the final and repeat what she did in the semi-final but obviously you had other, other plans how did both races differ from your perspective um, well, Desiree, first thing I'm going to say is she's phenomenal. She's performed so well this year. And um, like, there's words cannot describe how talented she is because I used to train with her back in the day. So I know what, how good she is. But um, yeah, she did put it on me in the heat. I mean, sorry, in the semi. And I knew obviously I had to bring it in the final. And I think I was, but because I was in lane three, I wasn't really in the mix as such. But I knew this was it. Like, I knew she was going to bring it. I knew Daryl was going to bring it. I even knew um, Imani, a young, another young talent, was just going to bring it. So I just said to my Asha, just get out, do what you do best, and then just hang on. And that's what I did. And I didn't even know I'd won at the end, honestly, because I just knew those girls were going to be there until I saw the replay. And, you know, I'm proud of myself for that. Because obviously, I, didn't, I haven't had such a good season this year. But I knew when it comes down to a final, that's when I know how to perform my best. And yeah, you've definitely got some fight in you. Um, what happens next? Where do you go to next? We've got Europeans coming up. The team will come out probably next week to find out if we're actually in the individual or not. So I'm not 100% if I'm... Do you want to do it? Yeah, I mean, I wouldn't mind, of course, because there's a, kind of a long gap. So I'm going to go and do the um, relay if we're not doing 100 anyway. I'm definitely going to do the relay because these girls, like I said, we can put, a great, put together a great team. And I know the Netherlands are going to bring it. So we want, obviously, because we've got like a good, cute little band that we're going on with them. So I'd like to perform well with that um, at the Europeans. And then after that, we've got the Muller London um, anniversary game. So well um, done. Yeah. Thank I you. keep making that mistake. That one. <laughs> I'm looking forward to that because obviously that's another in London, my hometown, and I love a British crowd, so I can't wait for that one. Listen, good luck. All right, well done today.